Hi guys, it's Isla back with a Julep mystery box unboxing. This is the Confetti Delights mystery box, <laughs> which was April's. Um, now, I like their mystery boxes because you get a wide variety of items. I just think the fact that now I keep on giving me stuff I already own, so I'm getting kind of worn out from them. But why I ordered this one was because if I saw on a spoiler site that you got a free necklace. But mine didn't come with one, so I'm just, and the fact the website itself didn't say it, so either they were already sold out and so they changed the ad um, or not, but whatever. I didn't get a necklace. So the Confetti Delights Mystery Box is $24.99, and you're supposed to get $100 worth of stuff, over $100 worth of stuff. And then I also added the Major Mystery and the Mystery Products. So let's start with the Mystery Product. The mystery product, I paid $9.99. Um, it was a It's Balm Full Coverage Lip Crayon in the color Flamenco Pink Creme. Um, and this is worth $20. So, good. And I do own a few of the It's Balm. It's one of their, one of their only lip products I actually do somewhat like. Um, and this color is bright pink but on me it looks great so I am glad to get this it's a color I would not have bought myself <laughs> because I'm not I mean it's freaking neon pink on here <laughs> but on my skin it looks good so I am happy to get this and this was a surprise for me then the major mystery add-on I paid $14.99 and it was an emery file Ooh, uh, Emery file was $5. I'm not sure I'd pay 5 bucks for an Emery file, but whatever. And then the Vanish Cuticle Softener and Remover, which I already have this, but I haven't been using it because I've been using my older stuff first before I use that. Um, but reading the box, it tells me that it also uh, um, helps discolor nails. So, and I've been having a few, it, it, it removes uh, residual nail stains. And I did have a few because of my nail polishes. So I did use my other one. So I am glad to get this. I'll have this on as backup. And this is $18. So my $14.99 was worth $23. So that's good. Now the actual mystery box itself is that. So first we have Feels Like Velvet. This is the full coverage eyeshadow duo. This is in Moonlight and Starlight, which I actually already own. <laughs> so I am going to sell this. I do like these colors. Um, this is how it came though. Um, but yeah, I do own this myself. I got it. I, have, I picked it out in one of my other, uh, I think my January Julep Maven box. And then I think my last mystery box also had like one of these in there or two. So I am going to try to sell this. This is $20. Uh, then I have Lux Up Your Lips in the color Poppy. Now, I do not like Lux Up Your Lips. Um, I got their original ones which is Lux Lips, and then they changed the name and got more colors, and I don't like those either. It's basically a lip um, balm that has a metal tip. I don't know if it's the lip balm itself or the metal tip, but it is horrible tasting and it's sticky. And it doesn't really have that great color payoff, so eh. This is $24. Then we have five nail polishes. We have the two that we were supposed to have had, which are Annabelle and Marley. Annabelle's the red one, the Marley's the blue one. Um, they're basically all, both confetti, which I don't like. <laughs> so all these are $14 a piece, non-Maven. Here we have is Amy. Oh, actually, I, sh I looked up what the actual information is. So Annabelle was listed as Floral Bouquet 
matte glitter top coat. Don't use glitter top coats. The Marley is aquatic blue matte glitter top coat. Then we have Amy, which is smoky turquoise creme. I do not like their creams. Um, they tend to just glob onto my nails, look kind of ugly and messy. Then we have Allie, which is hint of mint soft focus semi matte. I don't like this color. And then we have Randy, which is pink plumera creme, which is also another cream that I won't use. So I'm going to try to sell these all. And I did not swatch the top on any of these. I just gave up. So I was like, nope, don't like these colors at all. <laughs> so the mystery box itself was worth $114. I got zero dollar value out of that whole thing. But the mystery products, I did. So I paid $38.29 because I used a coupon. Um, the box was worth $157. My value was $43, so I still made more than I paid, which is good. But uh, I won't get it again for a while. Every time I say that, I do buy it again, so I don't know. I am getting next month's Julep box because they have a new lip product I want to try. So thank you for watching. Bye.